All right, I'm in Arnhem, and uh, I've been drinking a lot, and this is the only game that I've been filming, and we're leaving in like two hours, but I've played a lot of games. I'm playing uh, Pim, the uh, Dutch master of bolt action. I'm playing my Falsham Jaeger against some partisans that you've seen before, because he didn't bring an army. Um, we've done the preparatory bombardment. There's my mortar. These guys, Angela Merkel, these guys, the 1050, these guys, and over here we've got a whole mob of unruly Dutch farmers who are upset. <laughs> so we're doing sectors like the last game I played against Mario, so we'll see how it goes. Totally sober, but very hungover. Turn one about to go. These guys had an amazing shot. We'll hit the, uh, his uh, sniper team, killing a guy. That's still in the game. Um, his uh, MMG team came over, took a shot at these guys in the garden. Oops, these guys in the garden. Uh, my, my section moved up. Take a shot at these guys, no hits. And these guys went foobar on a, on a rally order, and they backed up exactly one inch. So we're gonna start turn two, and uh, see how it goes. Okay, we're heading into turn three, so we just finished turn two. Um, I brought my flamethrower on here. Um, the Indians have come up behind the wall. Merkel moved back to help them. Uh, Dieter Metzger, they broke cover, but that puff of smoke is a shot in from the air observer over there. His flamethrower has also broke cover and he's running towards the house. These guys got a couple of pins. These guys have rallied. The Shrek team down here came on and took a shot at the uh, MMG team or LMG team or machine guns over there. Clink and Schultz are now on the board. There they are. And uh, the battle bus is on here and his big mob of super veterans are coming on too. So we're gonna go into turn three. I gotta go get a Coke. And then uh, we're going to finish turn three. Um, the mortar took a shot at his flamethrower, who is over here, who flamered these guys. They're down to half strength, but they're still holding strong. These guys took an airplane hit. They lost two guys, I think. <clears throat> Clink and Schultz took some pot shots. The Shrek, where is he? There he is. He whittled down the LMG team. Um, these guys are all breaking cover. They're all heading towards us. The Indians did an amazing job. Sanjeev is going to win the Eastern Purple, uh, Eastern Eastern Pe Purple, oh, fuck, Eastern People's Medal of Merit. I think it's what it's called. Took out the bus and a couple of guys. Good shooting, Sanjeev. And uh, over here, they're just heading my way. So we've still got the bombs, but the Indians are going to hop the fence and take them out. So we'll see what happens. <laughs> okay, we just finished uh, turn four. Um, my mortar is ranging in on those veteran guys there. Um, the Indians have gone forward. That bomb, the bomb that was here is a dud. Uh, Merkel moved to give them some support. His bazooka guys broke cover. They're over here and they shot the bazooka. These guys, nothing happened. Uh, my guys in the trees here. Fired those guys, killed three. The flamethrower moved back over here. Over here, the, the medium uh, howitzer obliterated a unit that was there. Um, the NCO survived here, hopped a fence, killed his artillery observer, was charged by these guys, so he's gone now. These guys are coming in, Clink and Schultz are holding the corner of the hedge, and these guys are coming down the street to take out the Shrek. So we're going to go into turn 5 and see how it goes. Okay, we just finished turn 5, we're going into turn 6. Uh, over here, um, his vet big veteran squad has been annihilated. His uh, leader is uh, darting behind the cover. Uh, the flamethrower team, and these guys are inching up. The medic is there. Sh uh, Clink and Schultz are here, and the mortar team is over here. Uh, over here is where it's gone pear-shaped. Uh, he's I think he's got this side down. Um, these guys are here. They're pinned They got a pin from the Shrek team. I lost these guys to a medium uh, Light mortar shot from these guys. These guys are now in the pile of corpses and burning hedges and these guys are moving in and that machine gun guys all by himself, but We'll see what I'm gonna do with these guys uh, It's the last turn. So, you know, we might do something crazy. So we'll see what happens. Okay We've just finished turn six. We're gonna be roll for turn seven. There's the dice count um, my mortar fired, uh, it was pretty ineffective, and I think the unit I fired at is gone now. These guys are all running up in a mob, they're chasing his, his officer off the board. Um, his light mortar is the absolute star of the match here, his, I think it's taken out two or three units already. Um, the unit that was here, they were uh, shot up by Clink and Schultz, and they bolted. Dieter's uh, guys here, they were assaulted, they survived, went into the woods, and he's, he's moving that way and uh, these guys took out the Shrek. So we're gonna do turn seven. Uh, he's kind of scattered and I'm in a big force on the other side of the board. So a lot of the action is gonna be sort of in this courtyard area. 
and maybe some shooting, but we'll see. All right, Dieter Metzger, he finally fell in battle at the very last turn, he was shot. Um, the final score was, uh, I got 12, Tim had 11, so it's a draw. Um, we had, still had some stuff, and we got whittled down near the end. He brought these guys in, that got him three points. Uh, my last big unit over here, they weren't uh, fully in this sector, so I only got half points. But it was a great game, um, a lot of fun, great, uh, great terrain, um, and uh, we went by pretty quick. I think we got the game done in about two hours, so well done on us, because it took us like six hours to do two turns last night. So, all right, guys, thanks for watching, and uh, we'll catch you later. Bye-bye. Shoo! Okay, I know I've been kind of lax um, <laughs> showing you this event that I've been talking about. So uh, there's been a lot of uh, binge drinking and tour groups and going to pair drops and all that kind of stuff. And hopefully I'll put that up. But I just wanted to give you an idea of the, the scope of the big game they're going to be doing. I think this is Hell's Highway. Um, these, those are some movement trays. These are the troops that will be participating. Um, some more scenery. And then it goes up and it's a U-shape. Then it hits the town like this. And then across this way too so this will be for the big game unfortunately I won't be here for that tonight because uh, I'll be uh, I'm leaving tomorrow back to go home so but it's been a great weekend um, hundreds and hundreds of figures you can see all the boxes and everything underneath it's been a fantastic event I can't recognize it recommend it enough and out here you can look there's the River Rhine um, it's a cloudy day I've already tried to take a look but you can't see the bridge here from here today uh, it's a bit bit hazy, but it's in the distance over there. But uh, it's been a wonderful event. Met a lot of new people. We had a great time, a lot of laughs. They even have a model of the hotel we're staying at, which uh, I think was a warehouse at the time um, that's in a lot of the histories of the uh, the battle. So, yeah, it's been great. It's been fun. Um, can't recommend it enough. If you ever get a chance to do this, if you ever feel like going abroad, going overseas for a weekend or so, or a week to do some uh, touring around and uh, some gaming, I can't recommend these uh, things enough. Everybody's super friendly. Um, there's a lot of shit talk, of course, but there's a lot of you know bottle drinking and hooting and hollering and stuff, and everybody gets to be 10 years old again for a day. So that's it.